Hello students, so we will continue with the differentiation of parametric function. The last three problems left, all the three problems are very important, remember, for all the three questions for three marks, remember that, okay. Huh. The first question, x is equal to a cos t plus log tan t by 2 and y is equal to a sin t. If you observe here carefully, dx by dt is very difficult compared to dy by dt. So, instead of finding dy by dx in the beginning, find out first okay only dx by dt find out only dx by dt don't find out dy by dx okay because dy by dt will be easy to find out so that we can do it at the end huh. now what is dx by dt a is constant what is the differentiation of cos t with respect to t yeah minus sin t plus log of tan t by 2 see this is a composite function this will be a composite function so you should use chain rule which is outer outermost function log what is the differentiation of log 1 by tan t by 2 then differentiation of tan what is the differentiation of tan secant square then last don't forget this differentiation of t by 2 what is the differentiation of t by 2 1 by 2 usually you leave this so be careful okay so three functions you have to differentiate log tan and t by 2 remember that yeah differentiation is over now you have to rearrange it properly okay you cannot use as it is it should be simplified just observe carefully tan t by 2 you can write as a sin t by 2 divided by cos t by 2 okay secant square t by 2 you can write as a tell me how to write yeah very good cos square t by 2 1 by cos is secant, so secant square you can write as 1 by cos square t by 2 and this keep half as it is. I hope you understood. I, I use very simple trigonometry, so you will understand easily. Minus sin t plus, now out of these two, one cancel, right? Huh. Tell me what is remaining, this two I will write first, this I will write next and last. 1 cos t by 2 1 cancel so this much can you tell me what is this 2 sin t by 2 cos t by 2 anybody saw this yeah very good what is that sin 2 theta formula right now what is 2 sin 2 theta 2 sin theta into cos theta right so therefore can you tell me what is 2 sin theta by 2 into cos theta by 2 reverse right hand side to left hand side theta is again I to 2 theta theta by 2 idrena gata adradu 2 times you know 2 times of theta by 2 you know just theta so this is a into minus sin t plus ena gata do 1 by sin t correct now 2 sin theta by 2 cos theta by 2 is sin theta so 2 sin t by 2 cos t by 2 is sin t so this will be a into minus sin square t plus 1 by sin t correct huh? so this is equal to a into 1 minus sin square t and agatha cos square t by sin t so this is the required dx by dt it's not over because we just completed differentiation of x with respect to t now we have to take differentiation of y with respect to t as well as dy by dt so next dy by dt what is differentiation of y a cos t this is very simple so i told take this later huh. now use a formula what is the formula for parametric function dy by dt divided by dx by dt so dy by dt is a cos t divided by dx by dt you know a cos square t divided by sin t a, a cancel cost 1 cost to cancel e sin t log at numeratic but so therefore it is nothing but sin t by 1 cost t will to the denominator in and play so answer is ha huh, this is a expected answer you cannot stop anywhere in between uh, okay in last video also you saw one expected okay work like this prove it is not prove that but still this answer will be ex expected by the teacher in exam remember that okay tan t for this particular problem and as i told this is an important three mark question remember that okay fine very good 
आई होप यू अंडरस्टैंड ऑब्जर्व केयरफुली फर्स्ट फाइंड आउट dx by dt प्रॉपर्ली देन dy by dt देन यूज दिस फार्मूला यू विल गेट आंसर वेरी वेरी इजीली नेक्स्ट वन दिस इज आल्सो एन इंपॉर्टेंट थ्री मार्क क्वेश्चन इट इज आस्क्ड इन फाइनल एग्जाम इवन दिस क्वेश्चन इज आल्सो आस्क्ड इन फाइनल एग्जाम सो आई विल शो यू हाउ टू आंसर दिस देयर आर टू डिफरेंट मेथड टू आंसर दिस नाउ आई विल टेक वन इजी मेथड ओके मे बी इट इज अ पैरामेट्रिक फंक्शन या इट इज अ पैरामेट्रिक फंक्शन बट वी आर नॉट यूजिंग पैरामेट्रिक फंक्शन डिफरेंशिएशन आई हैव अनदर टेक्निक टू सॉल्व दिस प्रॉब्लम वेरी इजीली without any difficulty or without using anywhere parametric function differentiation so even if plus is a parametric function now i am using other than parametric function see this it's a simple trick x is known y is known just multiply a multiply mode and they know x in actually root of a power sin inverse of t correct what is y root of a to the power cos inverse of t correct alwa I didn't start differentiation. Observe this carefully. I just multiply this x and this y. Ha! Left hand side ha gaya rata x into y. Idhar leno change hoila. Arta hai talwa. Ha! Idhar multi since both roots are same, so you can write inside the same square root. A to the power cos inverse of t. Both root okay same, so you can multi write inside the same square root. Bases are same, so what we can do since bases are same, you can add the powers. Since bases are same, you can add its powers. So this is equal to root of a power. Did you remember this? Sine inverse of t plus cos inverse of t. Then we have inverse trigonometry. Sine inverse of t plus cos inverse of t. What is sine inverse of t plus cos inverse of t? Yes, very good. Pi by two. Sine inverse of x plus cos inverse of x is always pi by two. So x into y is equal to root of a to the power pi by two. So now this is ready to differentiate. Observe carefully. I didn't do any more differentiation. I just rearrange the given problem. The given problem is also equal to x into y is the root of a to the power pi by two. Now differentiate. X into इधर है एक differentiation मारते रहे product of two function x into differentiation of y plus y into differentiation of x you know one equal to इधर है एक differentiation मारते रहे root of a to the power pi by two first outside function is it no this is a constant function what is the differentiation of constant zero यार constant इडी a constant pi by 2 is constant so square root of a constant definitely will be a constant so therefore x into dy by dx is equal to minus y therefore dy by dx is equal to kena gata hai minus y by x so this will be the answer see what is us dy by dx is equal to minus y by x we got the answer this is a trick that's one trick this is not using parametric function i didn't use anywhere parametric it's almost like implicit function you can use maadbodu nothing to worry here they are not asking mention use or prove that using parametric only you can use any method this is the best method compared to the parametric function differentiation to answer this question ee particular problem exam alli kelidare nen pelli for 3 marks understood artha aithala trick just multiply okay ha next question this type of problem you solved in the previous okay video also but again i am taking this because this is asked in final exam for 3 marks this particular problem is also asked in the final exam for 3 marks this is a basic concept of parametric functions only so in parametric formula dy by dx is equal to dy by dt divided by dx by dt why any lane what is y a into 1 minus cos theta so can you tell me what is differentiation of a into 1 minus cos theta differentiation of a and agate constant so hage irutte differentiation of 1 is 0 minus differentiation of cos theta you know minus sin theta correct no a into 0 minus minus of minus sin theta divided by dx by d theta again a will be a constant so it will be multiplied since it is multiplied with a function differentiation of theta with respect to theta differentiation of theta with respect to theta in agate 1 differentiation of sin theta cos theta so a a cancel so what is remaining It's minus minus cancel agi plus sin theta by 1 plus cos theta ee particular problem ko the expected answer like sumne i answer and underline maat bade this is three mark question this if you observe this is definitely not worth not worth for three marks if you just stop your work here
So here expected work, I'll show you on how to get that. Sin theta in formula, huh, you know already it's so many times is used. 2 sin theta by 2 cos theta by 2. Because of this plus, 1 plus cos become cos square theta by 2. I hope you know this, right? Huh. 2 to cancel, cos theta by 2 cancel. So, what do they know? Sin theta by 2 divided by cos theta by 2. What is sin theta by 2 by cos theta by 2? Yeah, tan theta by 2. So, this will be the expected answer for this particular problem. Please remember, all the three questions asked in the final exams once and all the three questions are for 3 marks. So, we completed derivatives of parametric function. The last technique of derivative is remaining that is the second order derivative. I hope you understood. Thank you.